All right, I'm real excited about today's hunt. Water's super low, and I'm gonna go out there deeper than I've ever been. One of the things I'm looking for is, there used to be an old bridge that crossed over here uh, before they put the new one in, and I have never found it. I mean, I found things that look like, you know, old swimming docks and things, but it's gotta be out there somewhere. Anyways, I'm in waders. And so I can only go out so far, but I'm going to push the limits today. See, see what I can find. All right, guys, see what we can get. All right, looks like they got me some handcuffs. They might have found me a little throwing knife. Okay, I chased this one around for a little bit. This is really cool. This is actually some sort of a suspender. Let me clean it up. Yeah, it's gonna be probably hard for you guys to see it, but there's actually a flower pattern along under here. Fancy schmancy. All right, let's play a game. What do you think it says? <laughs> I think it might say Pinto. I don't know. Look at this watch. That was sure booming. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, I don't know. You know what? I think this might be a dive watch of some kind. Well, that's pretty cool. Man, I got some sort of weird clip here. I think it's got some edge to it. I don't know what it is. Interesting, though. Let's keep going. Look at that. That's definitely part of a gun. No doubt. There's the sight. Hmm. Huh. I wonder where that used to be. Maybe there'll be something written on here somewhere. To check it out. Well, that's kind of cool. Got me a fork. Well, there's the relic. So they got me part of a watch here. Well, I hear you always dig up quite a bit of ammo. Here's a live round, though. <laughs> Never fired. There's some sort of little relic. Could it be a piece off of jewelry or something? It's definitely pretty. Awesome. Oh yeah, there it is. So, there's a couple of stumps over here. And I'm way out here that my recorder awesome Let's do it here yeah wash it up a little bit all right looks like a 1911 boom well that never gets old man I think I must have found an old swimming spot look at that an old V-nickel. So the barber quarter was just... It's hard to see from here, but it's just right in here. There's a bunch of old posts. And I'm way out. Oh, that's so cool. Mm. Yeah, that's going to be a beautiful one, too. Looks like 1903. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. Huh, you almost used to swim right here. Yeah, I'm out here like as deep as I can go. I gotta have to take my gloves off because I keep getting my hands wet. 
I just got a ring. Is that like a Captain family? This might be a really old, old ring. Yeah, it's probably brass actually. Kind of feeling like this is might be an old brass ring, but man, that could possibly be gold. I'm gonna have to test that. And I'm out here so deep, guys. And I have confirmed that not only am I in the area that seems to be uh, where the bridge was, but there's a wagon wheel over here. I'll show you in a sec. So I'm thinking it's brass. But the funny thing is, I don't know if you can see that. It looks like they made some sort of a size adjustment and they used gold to solder it right there. A neat old ring. Can you guys see that old wagon wheel in there? That's awesome. I guess it's a wagon wheel. I'm no expert on it, but it looks like it to me. Wonder if I can get it. Okay, so I was able to get my scoop on one of the points. I'm just gonna drag it in. And then there's a bunch of people around, so I'm not going to fully retrieve it. I'm just going to get it to where I can retrieve it for later. Just too many eyes for something like this. Oh, cool. Yeah, it looks like the, the main support just broke off and twisted. Oh my gosh, guys. Look at that. <laughs> That's crazy. Ah, it's beautiful. That's my second spur, but... Ever, but wow, that's a... That's a beautiful one. Oh my gosh. No way. What an amazing find. I could even have a little piece of leather still on there. Wow, it's in such good shape, man. I don't even really have to clean it up. Sweet God. One of them's broke off. See that? One little tine there on the star. I mean, I guess this other whole side's broke off too, but at least I think it's broke right there. I'm pretty sure it's a U shape. Now, there's definitely some history out here. Let's see, I'll show you what I'm. See them, see how there's these stumps in the water? Well, then they just, they keep going. Clear over there. Man, I just, I'm gonna do as much as I can, but it's so deep. I'm sorry, <laughs> my arms are all wet. This is frozen water. I mean, <clears throat> this spot's open, because it's actually the river. And I think they used to cross here, and the ferry came here. And then, of course, they put a bridge here. But anyways, yeah, most of this lake is still frozen, so I'm out here in ice water. <laughs> I'm even holding my detector all weird, but hey, I got like a 21, 22 down here. I don't know if I'll be able to do the whole thing as a live dig, because I can barely reach, but let's see what we can do. At least you know what the number was. Before I pull it up. Huh. One scoop. That's not a good sign. Here's that. Guess it could be a Indian head penny. Lucky.
You know that guy? It's a coin. No, it's not. It's a button. <laughs> uh. yeah. I don't even know if that's a button. I'm not sure what the heck that is. Okay, I got a little button here. A little two hole. Well, hey, I pulled a weedy. I have moved away from the kind of bridge thing a little bit just because it's so deep out there. I think I got just about everything I can get right now. And I had to come out here and warm up, but I'm going to keep gridding out here. See what we can get. And then I might end back over there again. Go uh, see if I missed anything once I warm up. Well, looks like I got the back to a pocket watch. Yeah, I figured that I wouldn't have to be right on those stumps to get old stuff. I thought I was going to have a penny. I guess that's some sort of car emblem. Or boat emblem, I don't know. So I got me another weedy. Alright, still in the old stuff. It's not as old as over there, but... Alright, I think I might have me another V-nickel. How crazy is that? Oh yeah, for sure. Well, let me wash it. Yep, this is 1901. Oh, awesome. And this spot's good. Okay, looks like I got some sort of little button. Looks like... It says... Lincoln. No idea. Never seen that one before. Looks like it was a two-piece. Backside looks like it's just gone. What's a relic hunt without a piece of harmonica? That's pretty cool. <laughs> it's like I saved a wagon wheel. Man, that was out there deep. That's quite a drag. Somebody had a real bad day though. What a sweet spot that turned out to be. My gosh. Gun, knife, got buttons, suspender clip, old coins, a spur, a wagon wheel. I mean, my gosh. It's almost a dream hunt. <laughs> I'm sure I even left some stuff out. Oh, and by the way, that. That antique ring, I think what it was is I think it might have been gold filled or something because it seems like there's little globs of gold all over it, but it, it's definitely a brass ring.